Tuesday. It's my day off from work and I just got to the gym right now. It's about to be seven. It's so cold. I didn't want to come, but my partner is back from her little getaway. So she's like pushing me to come to the gym and that's a good thing. So we're going to do the one hour class and then head home and just see what the rest of the day has for me. Um, not a lot planned, but I do have to go to the store, so I might just go to the store after working out, but we'll see. So I just wanted to check in real quick, start this vlog for my day off from work because this is usually when I'm able to record. <laughs> I did go to the gym i went at seven and then after i went to walmart to get a few things that i needed for today and so now i just got home it's already late it's 9 30. right now i'm gonna put away the things that i i got and i'm gonna shower get ready and have coffee and breakfast because i'm starving so I just need to get my day going because my house is a mess right now so I have to pick up I have to be quick and I also want to take some time to just relax so I have quite a bit of things that I need to do so I need to hurry up now everything is so expensive I didn't even get that many things because I didn't need so much I just got these things and my total was 48 in change um pretty crazy i just finished washing dishes which is my least favorite part but let me show you what i purchased uh, over the weekend at ross i found some cute cups and i've seen a few people show different ones that they found at like tg max with different designs and i think there's like a very popular kind of expensive brand that came out with some like that so I found these at Ross for $3.99 and they are very thick. It looks like it has glitter but it's just like bubbles from the glass and little skulls. They only had two so I had to get them. But anyways, I'm going to make me some breakfast now because I'm so hungry and I need coffee. And it's already 10.30. Like the time is just flying by today. I feel like I shouldn't have went to the gym but I know it's good for me. So... I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take it as something good even though it took a good chunk of my morning but it's fine okay I was not expecting my coffee machine thing to make a mess but I don't know what happened it just like exploded or something I don't know at least my breakfast turned out good I'll have to figure out coffee right now but that's breakfast I decided to make me some nails so that's what i'm working on right now but i just there's just something not working out it's funny because um i make me nails and then i get tired of wearing them within like a few days i want to take them off already so i guess press on nails work for me for that reason okay i finished my nails let's see I think they came out cute. Hopefully they will not be annoying when I need to type at work because I'm on a computer all day long. So sometimes it can get a little frustrating. But I think this shape is fine. When I do square, that's usually when I have more of a problem typing. But this shape should be okay. I'm going to take some pictures right now, um, see how they come out. So that I can maybe post these on my Etsy shop because I like them. So we'll see. But anyways, I'm going to go outside, take some pictures and then get started on dinner. And also I want to make some cupcakes again because 
Last time I made them, the kids really liked them and they were gone within like a day or so. Oh, I am super sore. But anyways. I'm gonna try to set up these bags for the kids already. I make these bags for the kids every year and I don't know, I just, it gets me like excited to just give them something, even if it's like very simple. Okay, this is the little one bag. I gave her some like little fidget toys too. I got me one of these. Oh my God, these are so good. And some pens and just chips and candy. Same for AJ, he has some fidgets here and a little toy. He could build a little car. There's a little fidget thing. A little yo-yo. Some little charms. And candy, it's enough candy. right now and it's time to get to bed so right now I'm just gonna clean my face and I'm going to read a little bit until I fall asleep I woke up pretty early even though it was my day off and I didn't stop pretty much all day I said I wanted to relax a little bit the only time today that I got to relax for a bit was when I was doing my nails and even that hurt my back so um, other than that I was just like cooking i feel like i was in the kitchen all day long and then i was washing dishes all day long too but yeah i got to cook dinner and make cupcakes and um i didn't really get to watch a movie and i took the kids to the store twice we went to get water and then we went to get cat food and then we went again because aj wanted to look for a halloween costume to go out on Thursday night with his friends and Leilani too so we went for a little bit and yeah so now it's time for bed I would say it was kind of an uneventful day off from work but I always find a way to stay busy when I'm at home I honestly feel like I work more when I'm at home because there's always something to do but it's okay I had a good day regardless I'm tired so I'm gonna get to bed. I'm not sure I'm gonna wake up for the gym tomorrow. But yeah, I'm just like super sore. It's hard to get up, it's hard to sit down, it's hard to walk. Okay, it is my lunch time. I only have like 10 minutes left and that makes me sad i just went to duncan and i got me an energy drink and i got some 
like hash browns with queso and bacon it was pretty good that was my lunch because i didn't pack anything today it's not the best option and i'm not being like healthy even though i did go to the gym and i'm just working out and i'm not eating right but it's fine but yeah i'm at work for another like five hours it just seems like today's going by super slow customers are being super weird today some are just like pretending to be nice and funny but they're being assholes and it's really annoying and irritating and then i have to keep like stepping in because yeah my managers are just kind of doing their own thing not i don't know whatever i'm just doing my job and helping as i can but um, I wish I was off early today because my kids are wanting to go trick-or-treating This is something that always gets me the mom guilt because There's a lot of things that I miss out on and things that I wish I could be there for It just you know for some people it may be like something small, but honestly like kids are growing up so fast and Leilani is already 16 and she's still wanting to you know hang out with her friends today, whatever, but I'm just saying in a few years that's not gonna be a thing anymore and I'm not gonna be there right now when I can because I'm working and obviously it's fine um, this is like what I'm supposed to be doing I'm supposed to be working and I'm taking care of my kids but at the same time there's so much that we miss out on and we cannot get that time back so I'm constantly dealing with mom guilt um, and I wish I could go back to when my kids were small and they're just not you know my son I'm still like hanging on to any moments that I can his voice still hasn't changed and he's still a little boy to me but I know he's growing up he's gonna be 12 in a couple of months I struggle a lot with that I struggle a lot with my kids growing up and I think it's because of that it's because I'm absent a lot um, like I'm there for them and I do my best to make sure they're taken care of and they have what they need and want but I know for just like certain holidays certain special moments I'm not able to be a part of it like even parent teacher conferences sometimes it's hard to even show up and I have to be taking the calls but that's life and it's it sucks so people that are able to be stay-at-home parents you know the time that I was able to do that I wish I could go back and hold on to those moments a little bit longer like right now just any time that I get with my kid and it's like my kid is hugging me or wanting to be around me I just take it in and I try to hold on to that you know and it reminds me of when they were babies and I would just hold them and just like in that moment I knew that I was never going to get that like that exact moment back when they were just tiny little things and then they grow up and now this is what we have and it's hard that's just a little a little bit of what goes in my mind when I'm away from my kids happy first of the month it is 5 50 right now and I was ready to go um my backpack is ready I'm ready for the gym my lunch everything was good but then I looked around in my house I looked at my kids lunch bag and I said I can't I can't leave so I have to like take care of some things that I probably should have taken care of last night but I didn't and that's just what it is so this morning I just had to change my priorities a little bit and right now it's time to do parent things make lunch pack it clean my kitchen so that i can have some peace of mind when i'm at work and that's what i'm gonna do so i skipped the gym my partner is probably not gonna be happy because today's partner workout and she was very clear not to miss partner workout but like i said when you have kids priorities are priorities and this is what i'm dealing with today so I'm not going to the gym on the first of the month, but that's fine. I'll go back on Monday. I'm just gonna take care of the things that I need to take care of and then get ready for work. I will just have like a more productive morning before heading out to work at like 7.30ish and it'll be fine. So 
that's what I'm doing. I'm just cooking right now, bright and early, but it's okay. <laughs> my coffee i'm not a big fan of hazelnut anymore or like the syrup but that's all i have right now so that's what i used it's actually really good it's actually really good i think i like hazelnut again but look how cute it's my cup The time has come to get ready for work and I'm um, drinking my coffee, I'm doing my makeup and we're just gonna, we're having a productive morning so far. The kids are on their way to school already and I feel good about what I accomplished so far. Now, like I said, it's time to get ready for work. I'm getting so many compliments on my nails so many and even from like men which is so funny that they actually pay attention i deal with a lot of older customers and they just seem to just pay attention to every little detail like if you cut your hair if you do your makeup a little different or your nails or anything <coughs> they pay attention they work a full day and i'm actually kind of sad because I work Saturday and AJ has a game and I can't make it to it because they decided to have an away game so they're gonna be playing out in Phoenix and he's actually playing at the high school I went to for freshman year which brings back so many memories just thinking about that school my mom's gonna take him so i will have to miss out on that game this is the second game that i miss because i work and it sucks if it was later on the day that would be fine but it's at two and that's usually the time that i'm barely getting home and it's um, almost a two-hour drive so there's no way i'm gonna make it on time tomorrow we'll head out there after mando and leilani get out of work and then we'll probably just like spend the night um, have like lunch there on Sunday and then come home now let me give you a little update on how work is going because last few vlogs I talked about how it was kind of stressing me out and I wasn't feeling it and all of these things but let me tell you that as the days have been going by and I've been just pushing myself to do these things and like the unknown and just like the more I push myself and put myself out there to try to learn things um it's getting easier and i'm just like okay i'm just gonna go with it and we'll figure it out there's still a few things that i'm just very like oh, i i don't know how to start <laughs> that process yet but most of the things um are not too hard everything has a solution well mostly everything has a solution it could take a long time to find the solution or fix whatever but it could be done so i'm learning and it's just getting better i'm feeling a lot better about going to work now i'm not feeling as like stressed out i'm not gonna lie like there's days that i'm just like man the rules everything is changing and it's like sometimes it feels like it will be a good time to change jobs and stuff like that but i know that there's always things that i'm not gonna like at every single job that i have so i just kind of have to remind myself that unless i'm like my own boss and even then it's gonna be super stressful i'm sure 
um, there's always like rules and things changing, policies changing, and that's just something that we have to learn to deal with. It's 9.28. I feel like such an old lady because I am sleepy now. It's like Friday night and I'm going to bed. But that's because I'm tired. I've had a long day and I work tomorrow again. So I have to go in at 8.30. I'm sad because AJ left. My mom picked him up pretty early today, so I didn't get to see him when I got home from work. And I'm not going to be able to make his game tomorrow. So... That makes me sad. I have to miss it, but you know, I just can't take the time. Unfortunately, the game is too early. If not, I'll probably be able to make it, but my mom's gonna be there and I think my dad too. Today was just one of those days. It was, <laughs> it was interesting. It was not the best day. It ended up good, but yeah, it was just, it was just one of those days okay that's all i have to say it was hard it was kind of emotional and just yeah just weird work was okay it was a little bit sketchy too some things um i wish i could just like talk about work and the things that go on at work and just the situations that we encounter customers we deal with and everything it's definitely interesting maybe later on i'll open up a little bit more about work but right now it's just i'm a little like iffy about it okay it's saturday it's time to go to work um almost time to go to work i'm parked close by because i left pretty early thinking i was gonna get me a drink but i decided not to last minute i'm just gonna make me coffee at work because i should not be spending money today it's a short day at work i should be off by like 1 30 or so and then i have to take leilani to work at three once leilani and mondo get out of work we're gonna head out to phoenix and stay at my parents house for the night and i think we're gonna try to come back pretty early tomorrow because we have a lot of things to do those are the plans so far today there's nothing else besides what i just mentioned and that's it so once i get home i'll just get my bag ready and just be waiting for Manuel and Lani to be off work the vlog is honestly like dragging for a few days because on my day off i didn't do as much as i thought i was gonna do so i didn't have a lot of footage but i'm just gonna carry it on for maybe just like today and tomorrow i don't know we'll see but i've just like haven't been able to record a lot of what i'm doing i think i've just been yapping a lot purse is a mess i have trash i have my little wallet i have this little bag that's empty now i have another empty little bag here i got this little microphone for my phone but i haven't even used it but it's there my name tag for work i have uh my little body spray this one smells so good it's from target I have a random charger cable here. I have some headphones. I have my work keys and I attached my little fidget um, clicky thing. This one's so good. It's my favorite thing. And then I have another fidget toy. This one's super cool. A hair thing. I have pens. Thing to clean my glasses little hairbrush and mirror a little camera a calculator my airpods my little coin pouch more trash my checkbook because sometimes i write checks i guess i'm old just kidding and another fidget look at this little fidget toy let me put it in like cheese they're magnets and 
And on the outside pocket here, I have a lip gloss, more trash, another fidget toy, and a lip liner, more trash, some candy, and some dimes. And now my purse is empty. But yeah, my purse is a hot mess. This is what I take to work every day. So I'm gonna organize my bag just to kill some time right now. Let's get to organizing my bag. organized now and clean. 